بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم now basically uh, the ccnp exams as we already discussed that you need to go through with one core paper one technology core paper which covers the foundation and the most common concepts which are covered in all the three other papers but typically you still see some routing concepts here but the more in depth of the routing concepts you generally find in this paper and you still see some of the vpn foundation knowledge here but then you you go you go more deeper into the vpn services with some uh, implementations probably in this vpn paper we still see some of the automation uh, options here but we'll will be getting more uh, deeper into the automation options in that individual papers here so the core paper as uh, the covers the foundation and the common concepts in all the papers generally but whereas the concentration exam paper these three here in case of service portal will get into more uh, deeper dive into the individual technology and exam wise you can take any exam any order so there is no kind of prerequisite here which means i can directly write this exam without writing the core paper also but if you are writing this core paper then basically this will be the eligibility for your ccnp so to get your ccnp you have to add this any one exam from this three and if you want to go for cci then you can pass this exam and then you can schedule the lab for the cci so this csp core exam is the prerequisite for to get your ccnp cert service portal certification as well as for your cci service portal certification here again as i said the core exam focuses more on the core technologies like uh, i'll just come to this core architecture services networking automation qs security and assurance and this core exam is also the prerequisite exam you have to pass to schedule your cci service for a lab exam and of course you can add any one ex concentration exam paper any one either on advanced routing or on the vpn services or on the automation concepts here okay so the main concept here is to adding or update update to the certification is like the software in the networking has been more common in today's network so basically most of the service providers need to take the advantage of the automation to scale their networks and also secure their infrastructure okay so again most of the service provider people or the service provider engineers need to have a wide range of skills uh, wide range of skills according to the latest um, latest technologies and the automation options okay so these certifications is going to validate your knowledge and also it is going to provide you some kind of uh, job focused skills on a specific uh, modules or the specific areas here 